Hello. Er ist genauso, früher war er genauso, wie er jetzt ist. Sprich, sehr emotional und mit Leib und Seele bei den Spielen dabei. Very emotional, very fast, very strong, not boring. He kicked everyone in his ass. He didn't differentiate between the level of hierarchy or status. No chess. Like no this. It changed his life and it changed the club. You cannot win without tactical things, but um, the emotion makes a difference. Bei Jürgen war das schon auch. Er wollte gewinnen. Er hatte den Ehrgeiz immer. I'm a totally normal guy. I'm the normal one. Maybe if you want this. <laughs>I understood the game much better than I could play it. <laughs> it's really frustrating, to be honest, uh, yeah. because you cannot use it as a player. Jürgen Klopp came to us as a forward on the right side, yeah, because he was uh, fast and he was great and he was good with uh, with that. Was good, but technical was not so so. <laughs> it was not his work. People was critical with him and number seven, Jürgen Globo, the stadium was whistling. <laughs> he was changed in the defensive, right side. And at this time, he was, uh, was a good player. In 2001, we decided to make him the manager. And that was such an explosion of emotion for all the people and the porters and all people living in this region and this, in, in this city, that this was, we started the greatest time for the club. We had all the big eyes. We were all astounded that that of einmal practice our midfielder trainer wird. Football becomes the game it is to, today because you work together. That's what I believe in. And um, if you do this, if we are strong in this. We will succeed for sure. Wir haben ihn von vornherein als Trainer akzeptiert, weil er praktisch schon, als er noch Spieler war, die Sprache vom Trainer gesprochen hat. Er hat uns. Everybody was surprised about our decision. They were surprised, and we were sitting there and we were laughing and said, "Okay, let's go. Let's have a look what happened." The change is life and it changed the club. Everybody was excited about that. Having memorable games in a row, that's my first idea, that the people really want to see the next game. You can't wait for the next game. That's what football should be. And if you can do this very often, then you will be successful 100%.
the idea always to get forward, to get into press situation. He formed it, a, a new style of, of playing football, always to give the power. He said, we are like actors on a stage. We are responsible for our supporters. We want to give them a good feeling. He gave the players the human warmness. They fight for him. They believed in him. You can't learn it. You have it or you have it not. It was unbelievable that we got in the first division after three years. And for him, it was an explosion for him too. Er ist eigentlich ein Spieler, er ist mehr ein Spieler gewesen als ein Trainer, sage ich mal, weil er praktisch ja unsere Sprache, Spielersprache spricht. Ja? Er hat gesagt, wenn wir nicht in der ersten Division nach einem Jahr gehen, dann werde ich den Club verlassen. And um, I think it was the most emotional experience for me in this stadium. It was the last game because we played versus St. Pauli and we had no chance to get up in the first division. And it was finally decided that he will leave the club. Five, five minutes before end of the game, everybody was singing, you never walk alone. And everybody was sad about his decision but they were glad to have a beautiful time together with him. He made a, a very famous speech to all the supporters because he said, everything I got, everything I am, you gave to me. One of the core characteristics of our club is the intensity and the emotion, the authenticity. And Jürgen Klopp is just himself. He's so authentic. When I came to Dortmund and when we started working together, it was not the best atmosphere. They felt they had to wait too long for the next success. What we did, we created a common atmosphere only for us. The team started showing the crowd that from this moment on we are prepared to do more, to make it easier for the crowd to enjoy what we are doing. He has a lot of power in um, bringing spirit to a team. In 2010, at the start of the season, no one, no one of all experts said the feeling that Borussia Dortmund could uh, win the title. And now uh, we win the title. It was unbelievable and with a very cheap team, uh, low budget, uh, the, the loan budget of the team was 38 million euros. That's nothing. Hello, my name is Uli Graf. I am the producer and the co-writer of the top song Klopp Popstar. Popstar. Come about because uh, yeah, Klopp was our, our coach, our famous coach and uh, we are uh, friends together and uh, we get the first champion of the, of the league and sing I write a song and uh, he was, this time he was a really pop star, nobody says when, and I take the, the line and write the line, Klopp or do pop star. His awesome ability was when he was able to talk to the people after a loss. I remember his speech to the people in London after the Champions League final. He was really able to spend hope to the people in moments where they were really, really disappointed. He kicked everyone in his ass. He didn't differentiate between the level of hierarchy or status. In the last year, in the seventh year, we had a bad uh, situation on, on, on Christmas. After 19 uh, match days, we were at the last position. One day, we used to sit together in my office and he told us, I know you would never say these words. And for that, I will say it, it's over. It was hard for us. Everybody was crying, everybody stand up. And I think it's uh, five, 10 minutes was applause for him. And he was crying also. We know a big area is gone and nobody knows it's coming back. We hope it's coming back, but never knows.
It's a special club and if I had two very, very special clubs with Mainz 05 and Borussia Dortmund and in this row, it's a perfect next step for me. And now I'm here and I, I, I hope to enjoy my work. All the people told me so much about the British press and so on, so it's up to you to show me that they're all liars. I think it's been a breath of fresh air to Liverpool. Klopp straight away has become a hero to the all Liverpool fans, especially his antics on the touchline and the way he carries on. You know, he's, he's just he's passing it through and through, which is what the Liverpool fans are looking for. That's why we're up here now tonight to get a glimpse. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we, only, we only come for Klopp. We start to play very emotional football because I think this is it's important at Anfield. Like so special because he is not a star. He's not the pop star or what you say. He is one of us. He was a poor sportsman and get to the hero. Liverpool fans, well, they're going to be partying right through the night after their team won the Champions League. These players and their manager have breathed new life into the legendary special relationship that this club enjoys with the top prize in European football. Guten Tag. Guten Tag. <laughs> nice to meet you. Yeah. Big Excited. honor. Ah, for Big me too. Honor. Me too. Oh, nice to no. see you. You got a map here. Yeah. yeah. That's my that's my specific German. <laughs> Um, no, that's uh, not that's Germany. Germany. No, no, no. That's the, no, that's the England. That's the, that's the England map for yeah. German managers because um, I had absolutely no idea. I know nearly all the clubs, but I had no idea where they are. Ah. So if you tell me so. Norwich is there, I would have believed. Yeah, yeah now I, I know. You know where Leicester is. Yeah, yeah. And some me people too. actually lived there before they became champion. <laughs> champion. Yeah. yeah. Nottingham, I know yeah. because of Robin Hood. There are a few tricky ones though. Like, yeah. Yeah. What? Tottenham Hotspur. <laughs> He might struggle to find that. Everybody can drink a beer with him. He has no fear to, to be touched or something else. Therefore, it was one of us. It was his secret. His best attitude is just to be himself. And he is a winning person wherever he is. He's just Jürgen Klopp. And Jürgen Klopp is able to attract the people. I would say he might be even the best solution for the problems we do have in politics because he's able to convince the people. So if the people would ask who would become maybe German Chancellor, I guess for some of them Jürgen Klopp could be the right chance. The life is so quick. What keeps you in the race is your experience. And experience is what you've done in the past and sometimes you can use the experience of other people and that's what we try. Jürgen is an original in coaching. He's nearly perfect. He is nearly the same character now, like he was a, a boy. He don't want to harm anybody or something like that. When he's quarreling with the referees, it's just emotion. It's a football emotion. He's living for football. That's just coming from the heart. He is able to find the right words for the supporters. It is very difficult to describe his personality, but it is empathy, it is a kind of love to all people. Thanks for checking out the BBC Sport YouTube channel. Remember to give this video a like and make sure you subscribe and hit the bell button so you never miss an upload. See you soon.